Well, good evening, everybody. This is your stay-at-home grandma. And this is what I got in my mailbox, which is kind of like the review box. It's more on the casual side because I'm not really doing it for anybody. Um, I get that a lot of different things are spray and things like that. But then I'm also going to do a little bag because I'm hungry. And uh, my husband doesn't really want anything for dinner, so I ain't mad at him. Because I don't feel like going out back in the freezer and looking for anything anyway. So we're going to play it by ear. I got some coffee and some um, cup of noodles. And see, he don't eat that. I do. But anyway, I got um, a little bit of chit-chat and a little bit of this and a little bit of that. So we be on and having fun. This is the um, Atomic Bear Prepared Survive for to Survive. And this is um this is a flashlight. I don't think the batteries are included. They might be, but I don't think so, but we'll see. No, they weren't. So I have to include the batteries in here, but this is a little flashlight. And um I have flashlights throughout my house. I'm a kind of a a person that um into survival and everything so I, I wanted this for my house and then I got one like I said for my son-in-law to put in his bag and one for my my granddaughter to put in her bag but anyway then I got I got this from Wish actually though but I'm looking for um the rug that I'm going to put on my kitchen floor All one piece. I thought they were stupid. It's all one piece. So this is the rug that I'm going to put in the front of my kitchen floor. Probably by my sink. I don't know. But it's a nice rug and it will match my kitchen because my kitchen's orange. So I like that. Let's see if I can get that up so you can actually see it. Can you see it? That's a design in it. So that's my rug. Then I got some Lily and Lush frankincense. I've been getting a lot of these lately. So I got this. And then I got. I haven't even opened it yet. I'm moving around because I thought I had something else. I didn't get very much, which is good because I don't need a whole lot of stuff, but you never know. Open this up and see what that is. Oh, healing baths. Well, that's the whole. That's the healing bath, yeah. See. Well, that's good. Because, like I said, you get ready to buckle down. I did some things last night and the night before. Not that not the night before. Sunday night. Not last night. Because I was on the computer. I don't know. And I was just typing things and then all of a sudden I had this desire to go to bed. I went to bed. And that was that. Just making sure I got everything. And then I was thinking I got enough in there. But um I was thinking about how it's going to set up my again, but how it's going to set up my schedule. So I'm going to do Tuesdays and Thursdays. I think I'm going to cut it down because I'm not going to get as much stuff. I'm going to probably do either Thursday or Tuesday. I don't know yet. As you know, if you don't know, Mondays is usually my day off from everything because I go to church on Sunday. So I'll probably do something early Saturday when I come back from the farmer's market because the farmer's market ends the end of October so then I'll be here in, in the winter time but um, I'll be home but um, 
I really want to, I, I'm thinking about, I know I got Wednesday, okay, so we'll see. And that will probably be some kind of cooking. More, no more bang, but more cooking. You know, I'm going to get, I found some really, I have had these old cookbooks for quite some time. And I've used them occasionally, but I'm using them more and more. And I'm actually getting back to cooking older things that are not so old that are, a lot of people are making new again. So I'm going to do those. And it'll be quick things, but, you know, things that you can do how to make like butters and all that kind of stuff and um, things that you can add in your butters and mayonnaises and or, or as they come, what do they call them? I forgot. I I'll, I'll, I'll forget it. Isn't that awful? But anyway, I'm going to do that. This is good when you, it's not something that I would eat often because it does have a lot of salt content to it. But when you're hungry and when you need something to eat, this is good because, like I said, my husband really didn't want anything to eat. I just came in from the VA and stuff, so I'm thinking, well, you don't need anything. And I forgot to go out to the shed. Because I usually go out long before I do my reviews and, you know, let it thaw out. I didn't even go out there today. It's not raining or anything, although it looks, it's kind of murky. But the sun's still out. So your guess is as good as mine. We're just going to do. But, what can you say? Um, so anyway. I'm trying not to do, if I do anything, it'll probably be a little bit of a mukbang for Sunday night. Because I'm really, by Sunday, by the time I come home from church, take the girls with me. Um, I'm going to try doing my dinner on Saturday night again. I was doing that for a long time. Then I, I don't know. You know how you just change up. So I'm going to try to do my dinner on Saturday night. That way I don't have to do it on Sunday. So this saves you. Not that church takes anything out of me because of you know, but put something in me that gets me through the week. I don't know how people make it without some kind of church or focus group or something in their life because I know. Some people don't believe in structured church. And I have nothing just to say about that because just because I'm a retired pastor doesn't mean that I don't understand human beings. I'm also a retired therapist. So some people don't believe in structured church, but they do believe in God and they do pray and everything. And then there are different religions, so I have to face that fact and I, I respect them as well. But how somebody actually makes it without having anything in their life is beyond me. I don't know. Because I'm not I'm not going to say it's going to make it easier because nothing comes easy. Okay? It may look like it for some people, but nothing comes easy. Nobody's lucky. They're blessed, first of all. And nobody who's blessed um, goes without saying that they didn't work for it. I don't care who it was. You know, so having said that, I don't see how anybody makes it without having some form of religion or some form of structure. And I'm not talking about ch church structure because I can tell you, I've seen people come in church from the pulpit. You get to look down to the pulpit, you really see a lot of things. Um, I guess they'll get it eventually, but for the beginning, they didn't know why they were there. They were just coming. Some people think it's fancy. Some people think it's protocol or some people think, you know, it's something that has to be done. And that's not the way it is. What it is, is, you know, going to church and thanking God for another week, another day, another minute, another hour.
So anyway, I should have my scratch here. And then I don't know where I told you this, but my son has a radio show. And he gave me some stamp sometimes. So I'm going to put some of the, um, something in there. I tried it before with somebody and it just didn't work out. Because people say they want to do things and don't always step up to the plate. So I kind of stood back for a little while and decided to rewrite it and everything like that. So now that I've got everything written down, I know what I'm going to do. So I'll um, send you that link in the description box when I straighten everything out. Anyway, I feel life coming back into my body again. I have to make myself eat. Because what I do is, I don't eat. I'm not going to say I don't eat. I do eat. And I don't eat like I should eat. And I don't, like I should eat something early in the morning, like about, early in the morning to me is 12 o'clock. And I'm usually up. But I should have, eat something early in the morning. And I should, you know, like, I should um eat my lunch about whatever and then some dinner. I have no idea who that is. I don't know. And we get weird calls. I mean, and, and what's really funny to me is that the people that call that say that you owe the IRS and stuff like that, they are so funny because I don't owe the IRS a thing. First of all, I'm too old to even pay taxes. I don't work. But they don't know that. You know, and usually it's some number that you can't even trace. So... If any of you are getting any of those calls, don't panic because it's not true. And then, just this week, these past two days alone, I won a grant from the state of the federal government that I never even put in for. I won a trip to somewhere that because I didn't even hear the end of it. I said, look, I got to go goodbye. I try to be civil with those people, but sometimes, you know, they get me when I'm working or they get me when I'm sleeping. I don't know. I'm not myself. So, anyway, it's October. And it's, mm, mm, I'm happy. I'm the month's by. It's September. What you put, tell me in the comment section some of the things that we need to cook for because it's still nice out but you know I want to do some fall recipes and stuff so give me some ideas to what you might want to see I know what you want to see for art but always put that down um the life of this housewife I am going to do that for Patrice again that was fun. So I'm going to do that fatigue again. But anyway, I'm going to go. I'm going to enjoy my soup and my coffee. I know my kitchen. Put my new rug down. And I will see you. I don't know. Tomorrow maybe. I know I'll see you Thursday. Oh, I got a tent coming. Don't ask. I got the kids a tent to give you sometime this winter so they got their little tent and they play outside however somebody sent me a tent so i told my husband he said well good because i can take a camping when i go okay some of the things that i get are amazing some of the things not so amazing but for the most part they're pretty good to me so you may see that first time okay look in the um Amazon bar. I assume that's coming. But I don't think I'm going to open it up here. I don't know. But anyway, like I said, I'm going to go and enjoy my soup, drink my coffee. Maybe back on. Who knows? But I'll see you later. I love you. Take care. God bless you. Bye bye.